saying, do you listen to me now? Are you living your dream life? Man, are you living your dream life? Like that life you actually wanted to have. Growing up as a child, that's what you're living right now. Is that? Okay. I have a sister. Mom. I have a sister. Yeah. You are living your dream life. Yes. Awesome. Don't worry. You get to understand what it means to live a dream life. Yes. Are you? Okay. So that's virtually every Nigerian. No. You are not living your. If you want to tell yourself the truth, you want to be factual. You are not living your dream life. Okay. Then I came here and I discovered that it is hundred percent possible. For me to do what? Live the life I have always wanted to live. Okay? Now, in this organization, there's one thing we do on a yearly basis, and that is charity. Okay? Every year, we go around to do what? To support the less privileged and make sure we put smile on their faces. Okay? Now, what you are seeing on the screen is one of them that took place. Okay? It's one of such that took place. Right? Personal protective gear and others. Ah, very, very nice. It's a little bit of a problem. It's not an illusion. I was trying to give 50,000 families across the six states and the FCC. And now, we believe that life is not just about what you can get, life is not about what you can give. So, the project is to make the Christmas a lot better for people. It's about mentorship. You are mentoring people from the world. They guarantee that for four years. The ordinary Nigeria is not transformed. When you see the family that the whole thing will have been done in the world, you suddenly begin to end the family. So we make money and we just know that what we're going to do is that we're going to do that. So it's not just about taking our own money, so we're not going to do that. Elsewhere, the nation of Canada, the exercise of health, the public, the mostly, and the arrogance, ensure that we apply the COVID-19 regulations. We have over 10,000 things, man. We have sanitizers, we have the infrared thermometer. Anybody will notice this before you are checking the temperature. Don't think of them, but I'm going to have so many lives. But if you can see that, let's say people capture this. Okay, so on the yearly basis, we get this done. Now, the entrepreneurial mentor of this organization, the president, is one of our great mentors. Now, let's listen to what he has to say. Frustrated, leaving behind a girl and not leaving up my dream. Four years later, I sit on a empire, living life in my head and living on my dream. What happened? What changed? I came in contact with the connected economy. And in less than four years, we had a connected economy. I built an organization of over 200,000 with hundreds of leaders who are not just living life with their friends, but helping other people live life. I look at myself, four years ago, I could see so many people where I was. I could see so many people struggling, so many people wanting to spread their wings and fly, and nobody can help them. For that purpose, the developmental is here. The developmental is here to help people to come up with that life of high desperation and reach out to the living life of their family. The vision is to raise in the living life of the vision of this organization, to raise 50,000 more Tamilonia in the connected economy. Now, the, the vision also is to, is to raise financially free people. Who will help to raise all that financially free people? That, that's the mission, all right? 50,000 more Tamilonia in the next year. That's the goal. At this point, we have went over a half of this, almost close to this figure, is what we have. Now the question is, who is the next to be part of this 50,000 more families through this organization? Now the goal is to create a family of billionaires who will use their money, their resources collectively to affect the world positively. Now look at it, if in your community, you are the only wealthy person in your whole community, in that community where you are poor. Oh. Same way, your family, you are the only richest person in your family. Now, only you, the drive motor, enter that compound. Is that family rich or poor? Poor. Oh. It's poor. The this organization comes to realize this, and we make sure that if you are going to that corridor of financial freedom, you get people around you, your brother, your sister, your uncle, your neighbors, your colleagues, whoever they are, you get them also 
to see this opportunity in order to get there with you. Now, when this will happen, is this what's going to be a better place or not? It's going to be a better place. Sure, that is it. All right. So that's what we are here, and that's why we are doing it. All right. Now, this organization, having been in existence for over years in this country and beyond, has been expanding to various places and parts of this country. Now, if you need, you can see we have lots of members, we have lots of partners of this organization. Over there in Abuja, we have lots of persons. We have also so much crowd in Lagos. We have in Odisha, we have in Oka, we have three places. Now, what are you seeing here? This one, is you're welcome to emerge with the world of life at the Velodrome Abuja. Are you ready for the emerge? In the Financial freedom. Yes. Money and right? Yes. You just go for financial freedom. And it is what? That's a good one. How about you, man? Financial freedom. Interesting. How about you, man? The same thing. We are all jumping into the same boat. And sharp sharp, we are moving. She even bought it. Even if I bought it. Alright. How about you, sir? What are we go for? Financial freedom. Awesome. Well, that is good. Your opinions are alright. Please, can you say that? Please, thank you. You're welcome. Now, like I said, the three of them are in the twine. The three of them work hand in hand to make sure life is good. Now, if you have all the money and then no time to actually cruise yourself and cruise the money, is that a good life? No. Now, you have all the money, but you, your health is in and out of the hospital. Is that a good life? So, the three of them are tied together. And this organization got to know this early enough and make sure you are the partner. Have these three to yourself to enjoy, all right? Now, what you want to benefit being a partner with this organization? So, so many, so, so many, all right? Now, you start to understand time that sits in financial. When it comes to making money, there is time, there is what, there is season. Even the money will make us understand that. Also, every single that's created on this earth, there is what? There is what? Yeah. Awesome. There is time and season, all right? Number two, you learn how to make new money out of the old. Three, you learn how to create wealth by empowering others. Four, you learn how our partners enjoy big travel to exotic locations on a 
yeah, the girl is five, you learn how to get the three with us to that. Right? You learn how you can get the three. So when we just talk, somebody just said, most of you said you prefer what? Financial freedom. But this organization will get you to have the three. Alright? And enjoy the good life. Somebody said the good life. The good life. Yeah. Awesome. Now time and season have changed. You agree with me on this? That time and season have changed. Who yeah. agrees with me? Is it true? Yeah. If it is true, let me hear you echo again. Time and season have changed. Time, time and season, season have changed. Of course that is true. Now let me get you to understand this clearly, alright? Now, there was a time when people who were wealthy of their time, who had the money and pulled around, those who were recognized as wealthy men of their own time were just the tribal farmers. Those who were wealthy of that time and farming, they know they now in their farm, they get that time. That was during what? Agricultural age. Alright? Our great, 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 great father. All they know to do to make money is to farm, steal the trunk, plant one or two, and they get their farm yield sold and make the money. Okay? Now, that was the time they had to get married to lots of wives. Men were getting married. Men that were men that were real men of the time. Make sure they have nothing less than five wives. You see, one man have five, six, seven, ten wives. What's the reason, actually? Just to have lots of children, especially male children, that will do what? Who will tell me? That will do what? That will help them in the farm. Awesome. That will help in the farm and work. And at that time, a woman married that has no male child or young and her case will eh? It could be like she's not contributing to the wealth of the family. It'd be like, we will work for you, make sure. That kind of thing. She could hear me. Nobody say me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that was it. Now, the question is, in the era we are now, presently, are people doing the same now? We have to marry lots of wives to farm and make money. Is that what they are doing now? That was the thing that's what changed. Now, we've marched to where? The Industrial Revolution. Do you know the Industrial Revolution is all about who has certificate, who, who went to school? Okay, and then those who went to school, which school am I talking about? Ordinary school staff. Let me just finish from this thing. Yeah, well, government job. They don't give her a motto, give her an office, give her a house, give her every incentive where her tie to her. In that look as though who get money now who goes to school, who gets anything. Parents started calling their children out of this farm. Well, Mr. John, yeah, he's picking a graduate. Yeah, he don't drive motor for me. He's not village. Only my picking never go. Oh, yeah, man, I go to school. You get parents, we are ready to sacrifice whatever it is to make sure that children go to school. Now, today, is it about certificate to have money now? Is it yeah. about government job now? Time and season has changed. Okay. Are we together now? So, that's the thing that we've got to wear to the computer revolution, internet revolution, and the same of internet revolution, those who went to the business, internet business, we are hitting money left, right, and down. That was the time where you need to check anything on the internet. You do what? You go to cyber cafe, sit down five times, 30 minutes, one hour, and then you browse. 30 minutes finish, you can never finish. Bring another 30 minutes. You see, now that you have a computer, another 30 minutes now, okay, bring another one. And they were hitting money, they were be doing business. Business was booming. Today, we still do all that. No. We still do all that. What do we need to try to do today? What do we, who can tell you? We use people? our smartphones. We use our smartphones. Thank you, sir. That was what we, that's what we are doing now. And before you know it, we discovered that that business is no longer what it used to be. True or true? Yeah. True or true? True. Yes. Those who have all those computer business, what they do now is that to copy type, project, and all of that. I remember in school when I was writing my project, now my phone I take browse. I just browse information, sit down, copy and eh? Copy and there was no money that I don't tell you my story. Huh? No money when I was in school. So what I need to do is I use my phone eh? I browse and copy, I browse and copy, try and go try. Now can't they write my project, honestly. Are we together now? So that is because of the smartphone. Now during this time, those men that were you know, they had the money, they had phone. Look at them the kind of phone they had that time. The wedding man of this time, they had phone. Who will tell me the kind of phone they had? Button. Oh, eh? What you want to do? 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 What you to do? What you want 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 to do? What also change it. Are we together now? Mm -hmm. And those who refuse to change at all with time keep on laboring to make money, suffering for January to December, and yet they have not saved the money. Let's go. Now, we move to where? To connected revolution. That's where the world is currently. Connected mm -hmm. revolution is all about making money, they are creating connections. 
and the people of our time, of this our generation, who understood the importance of making money, they are creating connection, started creating connection and they started making money. And today they are so, so wealthy that no matter what is melting down today in the whole world, whether economic meltdown, global, whatever, they are not person, they are not shaking, they are not worried about the increase of dollar or increase of whatever. Why? Because they have still accumulated wealth such that no matter what happens, Poverty can never, never be their base again. Are we together? Yeah. I'm going to be showing us an example of such people. Now, the world is going well. It's matching into its artificial intelligence revolution. That's where the world is going today. It's not about Nigeria, it's about the whole world, okay? This is where internet, I mean, this is where computers and robots take over the activity, the mass power of humanity. And this is how many people are going to keep on losing their job. To what? To robots. Because no matter your field of endeavor, no matter what you think you do, you are a sinner, you are a different, or whatever you are, a computer is coming soon, a robot that can do it better than you can do. Today we have robots as, as teachers, we have robots as nannies, we have robots as a whole job. Now listen to this very thing. The same job that they are uh, 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 replacing in the near future. We need to this job unnecessary. Number two. Transportation. Self-driving vehicles and drones will take over transportation jobs. Number three, manufacturing and assembly. Robots and AI-controlled machines are replacing humans in factories. Number four, retail and customer service. AI chatbots and virtual assistants offer better customer support. Number five, banking and finance. AI finance fraud performs financial analysis and automated data. Number six, IT, IT. AI automates tasks like software testing, reducing the need for some IT jobs. Remember, new jobs will also emerge. New AI jobs AI were made as AI, AI advances, so stay adaptable. If your area of endeavor is not mentioned yet, it says keep, it says keep your AI down where we have gone. If you do it, then we'll soon get there because AI is what is advancing. Now, robot is already here with us. Okay, we now have robots in Abuja checking people into their hotel rooms in some big hotels in Abuja. We have robots as teachers today. They are watch over the uh, the social media where it has already been introduced into Fed banks in Lagos, so it's already there. Yeah, and a lot of us now, for instance, when uh, ATM machine came into banking industry, do people do some bankers lose their job? Do they lose their job? No, they didn't lose their job when ATM came. And even POS has even added. And some bank has lose their job. I think they, they have lost some of course, job, yeah. Banks bank started retrenching. Yes. Started laying off some workers. However, the neighbor, the, the, the electricity, whatever you call it, mm. when prepared meter came, do people lose, do they lose their job? A lot of people lose of their them. job. In fact, I have a relation that it also affects them. And that was why so they are playing against it. Yeah. Okay? But the big aspect of it is coming in no time. Okay? When you will have it everywhere now, watch this very well. She mentioned what in the transportation industry. Now, this is a very good driving system. No driver is self-control. And this thing too is going to obey all traffic rules. We carry passengers, we drop them at the point they want to highlight. Now, watch this very well. Watch this very well. <laughs> I Okay, can do it better, more accurate, and faster than the ascendant 
would do. Okay. So what do you think? You think the the the, the, the twelve or the session owner will keep on paying girls that are making mistakes, huh? or to buy the machine once and for all and we do the work better? Which is what do you think they will do? Right. They will buy it, of course. So that means that lots of girls will also lose their job. Now in the game, of course, robot can as well, you know, entertain people. Robot can also play games. Now, however, health industry is not left about to let out. Now imagine if this day was to do. And now a patient has come in, robot is not any temperature. Robot is not any data. This is very well. Shut up, Kumar. Phone number this. Let me check your body temperature. Please take a step back and look into the camera. Your current body temperature is 100.8 degrees Fahrenheit. Do you have a fever? Cough. Through a fever of difficulty in breathing? Yes, I'm feeling feverish. The screening is complete. Okay. Now you will need to go to the clinic for further assistance. I see that you have a fever with high temperature. But you see that that information has already been transferred to the next one. Now, the body will not be too attentive. Can I have any toast cream or breakfast mix? No, no. It looks to be normal for you and not for you. We three will issue the entry last week. Thank you. You are sewing. Please collect your pay. So that is where you want to find out. Now, you can see that you can't be told. You are looking at all these things. You still want to find a reason to tell us what you are doing. Why are you doing this? This thing is not going to be wrong. You want to know if you are going to be wrong. You want to know if you are going to be wrong. So that's where the whole world is. To match it, okay, is really, really very good. It's going to make life very easy. But there is a trouble. Who will tell me the trouble? Many people will lose their jobs. The trouble is that many people will lose their jobs. The trouble is that unemployment, of course, yes. Unemployment is going to be on the increase. On the increase. And the, now all of us are saying no job. You see somebody graduate today. A woman has graduated from school. If you go to your phone, you will see PSTMT holder selling tomato. Is it true or false? Yes. Now if you check the street or the road of this Asaba, you see a lot of keke. Majority of them are graduates. Keke riders. Majority of the Okada riders in Asaba are what? Even in Ango and all these other places. Are graduates. Are you aware of it? Yes. They are graduates. Now, the pain you know, is that some persons manage to get the job, work for 35 good years, serve their country, no judiciously and religiously, and do us retire and then broke. They retire and get no money. The home they are, is what do you look for? The pension is not paid. Some of them are paid for very tiny that cannot take care of their mentality. During the days of their service, Regina Liu is one of the retirees struggling to survive. She retired 10 years ago and presently gets 30,000 naira monthly as against her expected pension. She and other retirees describe the situation as unacceptable. In fact, the pension is nothing to talk about. I retired 10 years ago. But what I'm getting is just 30,000. With children, you know how Nigeria is today. We cannot be able to cope with that's it. Okay? That is the situation. Now look at what the current condition. Where are we today? Look at prayer. Look at dollar. Look at now somebody will say that he go better. That's the prayer of the majority of Nigeria. You say don't worry, eh? Let's wait. She'll be not even there now. Who will know the next president where to come? Maybe he will be attacked with that president. I pray. When it was here, we were crying. And we were trying that when this one comes, this will get better. Did it get better? Mm -hmm. Okay, this one for what now? We see the one of that thing. I mean, I'm too. When it comes, is it exists again? Is it getting better? So the best thing anybody will do for his or herself is try to get your own economy better. Because if you are looking at this country, we get better. I'm sorry. And you are training your children in school, you think when they graduate this will get better. Oh, oh. I did not say graduating a good job. I have seen a lot of them all over everywhere. That even after their parents have spent so much training them from school, their parents, their children graduate and 
still be asking them for urgent to cake. Mommy, give me money, my soul. It's quite terrible, very, very terrible, okay? So that is